what's up guys, I'm Jake here. And today I'm going to tell you guys about a little nightmare I had. I'm actually excited for this one. So, it gets a little confusing, but bear with me. Alright, here we go. Mexico, 2018. Nighttime. Me, my parents, and all my friends were walking through this building. Alright? And there's a big party going on in Mexico right now. Big fiesta! You know, the dancing, there's music, there's, there's party streamers, there's, there's chips flying in the air, there's salsa they're going back and forth. Uh, Mexican drinks shooting out of fountains. And you know, there's lights hung up all around. Red, orange, yellow lights, pink, light green, black, white, whatever. Whatever the Mexican colors are, they'll, they'll get the color of the, of the lights. You know, you know, we're just, you know, walking, you know, dancing a little bit. And we're into the building that we're going to. And it's a little dark. And then it get darker and darker and darker. I'm like, what, what am I doing? So then, you know, I grab onto my, grab onto my stepmom, I'm like, you know what, I don't want to get lost in here, I'm just going to hold on deep. And so, you know, we're just walking down this hallway, and at the end of the hallway, there's like a little blue light. And as we're walking down there, the light gets bigger and bigger and bigger. We enter that, we enter the room, you know, where the blue light is. Oh my God, I'm freaking out. Sorry, uh, I, I had to sit down around. I was being tired of standing. Anyway, take my hood off because, you know, it's hot. Oh, good. So, anyway, we enter this room where the blue light is coming from. Oh my god, I'm freaking out. The whole room is made of glass, alright? The ceiling, the floor, the walls, the corners, everything was made of glass. And guess where we're located now? We're no longer in Mexico. We're in the middle of the ocean. All right, the middle of the ocean. I look above and below me, out to the sides. All the creatures are just swimming. All right, there's sharks, there's jellyfish, electric eels, snakes, fish. And they're not even the nice kind of fish. They're the mean ones, you know, like the ones that would just like bite your finger off. I don't know what you call them. They're, they're fish, whatever. So, you know, I'm like, oh my god, I don't like this. I hold on, I grab my stepmom and I hold on to her. I'm like, get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here. I don't want to be here. They can, they can, I, I can't do it. Get me out of here. I'm scared. I don't like this. They can crazy. Get me out. Get me out. Get me out. I have a mental breakdown in the middle of the freaking room. You know, I look up, big old snake staring down right at me. Its mouth is closed, all right? It opens its mouth, sharp rows of teeth, and it show up. You, know, you can see the inside of its mouth, all slimy and pink and bumpy and gross. You know what the snake does? You know what the snake does? It shoots down right at me. I'm like, oh my god. And it hit the top of the glass. Surprisingly, the glass didn't break. So I'm freaking out at this point. I'm like, oh my god, get me out, get me out, get me out. You know, I went next to me, there's a shark swimming right by my face. Uh uh. I look below me, freaking electric eel circling my feet. I'm like, uh uh. Nope, I'm done, I'm done. I look to the other side, there's a jellyfish. Stinging the crap out of a fish. An innocent fish. <laughs> Killing the damn thing. I'm like, oh my god, this is torture. What, what am I doing here? So, you know, while everything's going on in the middle of the ocean, you know, I'm like, yeah, I'm leaving, I'm done. So, I see an exit. I go to it. And I mean, all of a sudden, I'm in a concert. Alright, I'm in the big old theater. 
a big old theater, you know, the stage, there's rows of seats, there's a balcony, and just all this awesome stuff. So, you know, my seats of course up freaking top. You know, there's some stairs. So I start I climb the stairs and uh, I get to the top, you know. I turn around, big old tank of water. Big old tank of water. It's like a random big old tank of water. And I look down. And there's just uh, you know, sharks and fishes and snakes and electric eels, you know, same creatures that were in the other room. You know, they're just, you know, swimming down there. And then I see a guy on a ladder throwing meat into the tank. I'm like, you stupid. Are you trying to get killed? Are you just trying to get killed? You know, because the, the sea creatures, they're like jumping out and eating. Going through. You know, they're doing all the crazy stuff, you know, I'm like, nope, turn around, look to the front, I'm very energetic, I'm sorry, and, uh, you know, I look on, I look right in front of the stage, you know, to the left of the stage, big old, uh, robotic, glow-in-dark whale, alright, it, it's huge, and it tail just keeps going up, been down slowly. I'm like, oh my god. And right by the whale is a big old shrimp. Glowing with dark shrimp. The whale is light blue and the shrimp is hot pink. I'm like, what the f is going on? And um, then the show begins. Now I'm going to skip all the happy stuff about the show because, you know, this is a nightmare. I'm just going to get right to the nightmare part of the show. There's this ventriloquist dummy that just appears on the stage, you know. He's, uh, telling some creepy jokes, doing a creepy laugh. And then he all of a sudden just starts, like, flying in the air. I'm like, what is going on? And behind him is another, it's a curtain, alright? He flies in the middle of the, of the stage, right? He's just floating there in the middle. The curtains behind him open up. On the left and on the right, rows and rows and rows and rows and rows and rows, rows and rows and rows and rows and rows of other ventriloquist dummies, boys and girls ventriloquist dummies, just hang there. You know, they're just, you know, like looking down, you know, just laying there like they're dead kids. Pardon if that was a little harsh, sorry, I'm sorry. But that's how it, that's how it kind of looked. And I'm just like, what is going on? And then a big old uh, blast of music, you know, comes out of the speakers, and every single dummy <laughs> shoots its face forward. And then they just start dancing and moving around and singing along to the creepy old song. And then they all just fly off their freaking stands and just start having this big old crazy dance on stage. I'm like, this cannot be happening. And then, you know, they all exit the stage, and then the main thing trope with dummy is alone. He just vanishes, alright? I look around, you know, my parents and my friends are just sitting there, you know, and then I looked at my dad, he's no longer sitting there. You know who is? That main ventriloquist dummy. And it's space just keeps on going from human to, to, to wood. Human to wood. And I'm just like, what the... This whole dream makes no damn sense. So, you know, him and I shake hands, we talk a little, and then he just vanishes again. And then that's pretty much where my nightmare ends. Crazy, right? Yeah, I know. Well, that's pretty much it. So, uh, see you later.